Guys, you know the stars here. The rabbit hole goes much, much deeper. Um, I did a little research on Heliophant and Louis Lefebvre because, uh, you know, after listening to his and watching his uh, interview with Alex Jones, I felt as though he was, as an artist, he was very detached from his own work and that he did not have logical explanations and, um, and an accurate understanding of, of his own work. He almost seemed to speak of it in third person at certain points in the interview. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, you know, go back and watch this interview with Alex Jones and you'll, you'll see what I mean. I, I get a, an odd feeling throughout this entire interview. Um, as an artist myself, if I have a work, I, have, I could talk for an hour on one piece of my work. Whereas this this individual Louis Lefebvre, um, you know, he seems to be short short of words uh, for the different explanations as to the different elements in in the uh, iPad Go Two, and um, it almost seems as there's a like there's a big white elephant in the room that they're not talking about. We, we hear simplistic explanations that don't do the film justice at all, um, and then on the other hand, he talks about you know how he worked on this for five years and um and that he went broke you know basically putting this animation together um all just to release it to the public without making any revenue off of it it just doesn't add up so i did a little research on louis lefebvre and uh what i found was pretty um peculiar louis lefebvre if you wikipedia search this person is also the first Catholic Bishop of Boston and guess who succeeded him it was a Pope Benedict which is just happens to be the same name as the Pope who resigned from uh, from the Vatican also if you look at the release date of June 25th for this uh, hill for for iPet goat 2 of 2012 all I did was do a Wikipedia search on June 25th the very first entry for that date in 253 AD was a Pope Cornelius who was beheaded he's the only Pope mentioned in the list of, of, of uh, dates or in the list of uh, years for that date and in the very last entry in the list on June 25th 2012 which is the exact day that iPet go to released that is the day that the final beam was list lifted into place for World Trade Center 4 so folks I'm afraid the joke might, might be on us with this uh, iPet go to um, I'm to the point now where I'm even questioning if Louis Lefebvre was the person who put together iPet go to now that's just my opinion, but um, I just presented you with some pretty hard facts and seeming coincidences based on, on some credible sources that you can research for yourself, and um, you can decide. But uh, I'm sure we'll uncover more in, in the coming days with regard to Louis Lefebvre. Take care and be safe.